Bloomies are forever. Happy Sunday morning, everyone. I'm Melissa, and today we will be packaging items from eBay. I sold 23 items yesterday. Few people have asked me to hold off, so they make the video. And that's what we're gonna do. We are going to take it nice and slow, relax. Hopefully this is a video you can put in on the background, put on in the background, or just kind of zone out. No loud jump scares, no ads past that front one. You're good to go. The first item I'm going to be starting with is, let's scroll down, the Brighton necklace. So here is what my box looks like today. This is not only just boxes in boxes, but the items I pulled are in this box. I tried to keep everything fairly simple. <laughs> You'll be seeing some new supplies, stickers, boxes. I don't know if I've shown either one of these tissue papers. Have some new straws, stickers, stickers, stickers. So the first piece I'm looking for is Brighton. I'm just gonna pull all of the Brighton pieces here as they have some fun bags. not Brighton. I think that's all of the Brighton. Let's set this aside. Um, we are looking for the heart butterfly. Nope. Nope. <laughs> There's a lot of them. You are. Okay. So the first piece to have sold to Lisa, I had a bunch of Brighton and I sold them out of my shop and they all went rather quickly. So this time I learned to put them on auction. So this is a butterfly. I think it looks like a butterfly. It's more of a heart, but that center bar kind of breaks it up into a butterfly look. So I'm going to put this definitely in one of our cute little teal padded boxes. Now because the padding, I wish the padding had another layer, I'm going to take some foam and cut off a little piece, which we can then roll up a little bit and put in the front. That way when they open it, it should stay in place. We will put this back in the Brighton Mailer. And let's wrap this up. I'm going to turn you down so you can hopefully see what I see a little bit better in all of the wrapping fun. There we go. So today I'm going to be using the Aqua tool somebody had so graciously gifted me. Um, the tissue paper I'm going to be working with, sorry, it's under the camera here, <laughs> um, is this Jilson Robert. Now this comes in two different colors. One is more turquoise aqua. And this one is definitely more of a greenish mint. This is this year's. And the aqua one, I guess this is more of aqua, but definitely more blue turquoise one was from last year. So I'm gonna cut this in half. And for those wondering, I did find a wholesaler for the 2020 Jilson Roberts prints. So what that means is Amazon, you can buy Jilson Robert tissue papers. You just need to either go into my link below where it says Amazon affiliate link, it's the first one, or just go to Amazon and type in Jilson Robert closeout tissue paper. And the closeout prints will be there and they're usually about $35 for 240 sheets and again you just saw me cut one of those in half. Jilson Roberts has a quality tissue paper. Nobody is going to be judging you if you have a lesser quality tissue paper but I really like Jilson Roberts and I get asked a lot where to get it. So Amazon definitely. Amazon doesn't have any of the new prints, any of their 2020 prints. 
So for that, you have to go to somebody else. I have purchased in bulk from several companies, and I specifically like Chris over at Mr. Gift Wrap, and I'll have his, his information below. He is a father. Um, he shared this with me, and I'm fine to share it. And he, one of his daughters has special needs, so he's been trying to take care of her as with everything happening in the world, um, her schedule has changed. So he gets back to you really quickly. He calls you personally. You can order any of the Jilson Roberts papers. He also has a website with some different papers. But the nice thing is you do not need a minimum. You can order just one pack, which is 240, and he'll, he'll ship it to you. So there's the first one. It matches perfectly. I'm going to show you two new business cards I've created. Now the first one looks almost identical to my old one. It says, you are enough. You are so enough. It is unbelievable how enough you are. On the back, I put thank you for your order. So some of my business cards had my store. I wanted to gift somebody something that didn't have any store branding, and that way my Patreon peeps that get some of these might be able to pass them along, and they don't say my store. We'll keep using my business cards on occasion, but I thought that might be fun. Another card that I ordered, and I have to contact Vistaprint. Vistaprint is the company by which I get my business cards. This says, I am enough. Now when I ordered this, the contrast on the enough looked, en <laughs> looked enough different, looked different enough than the background, so it really popped. I liked the way the I am didn't pop but it's not looking as a vibrant in person. I'm still gonna go ahead and use it because I think you can still read them, but I have a call into Vistaprint and I won't be surprised if they fixed it. They have really good customer service. Okay, so Lisa ordered this. Let's just make sure Lisa did not order anything else. I recognize most of the people on this list, but there's a few that I'm like, huh, I wonder if she's ever purchased from me. So here we go, Lisa, where do you live? Lisa lives in New Jersey, and she paid $17.50 for the, I almost said bracelet, for the necklace, and $3.99 shipping. So I'm gonna put it in an aqua mailer. These were 10 cents when purchased in bulk, and we will do a vitamin face mask. We have that all sealed up. I'm going to say it's going to weigh about four ounces. 2.3 ounces, so we round up to three ounces. And my dimensions, I always leave at 12 by 12 by 2. And this is actually a lot smaller than that, but it won't make a difference, and you'll see that in a second. So right now I'm gonna leave it 12 by 12 by two. That's my default for any of these smaller sizes. Update, my cost is $2.93. Now let's change the dimensions and try six by six by two. This one's a little bit longer than that, but again, didn't change, $2.93. Now let's put 18 by 18 by two. The cost is $2.93. At some point it will raise the rate, but I'm gonna leave it at 12 by 12 by two, and unless I have a big, big package or a box, that works perfectly. It saves me a little bit, little bit more time while I'm leaving them pre-filled out. So I'm going to go ahead and purchase this. Like I said, she's in New Jersey. I'm in Florida. It is Sunday, so this won't mail out until tomorrow morning, Monday. And let's see where I wanna print this to. I have this set up for my Dyson 4XL. Let's see if he is on. I purchased my 4XL from another eBay seller 
who said sometimes it has issues, it mostly works, but once in a while it just does this little fluky thing. You have to unplug it, plug it back in. And they were very right. It does do a little fluky thing. And I'm glad I tried it. I don't know if this is worth replacing because this weekend it would not work at all. <laughs> and I don't know how to fix it. So if this poops out here, it was only about $70 and it is a $200 machine. So I got a great deal. I know going into it, it might've had an issue or two. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna try since I already have it in this format is to turn on my regular printer. Oh. Did it do it? Did it do it? Is it gonna print something? That'd be pretty exciting. Watch like 87 labels suddenly come out of it. I heard it connect. It goes long periods of time working and then suddenly it doesn't. And again, it's just because I bought it used. The Dymo 450 Turbo, still my favorite. The 450 series, doesn't matter, turbo, non-turbo. Love that one the best. Okay, so I am going to turn on my regular printer. Make sure I have some label paper in there, which I do. And we will just switch over and have this print to my regular printer. It's gonna take a little bit of time. During that time, my mom is coming this week. So this is Sunday. She's coming Wednesday and will be leaving Saturday. Her oral surgeon is down here. If you didn't know, she's getting implants. She is so close to being done and they look great. I'm thrilled for her, honestly. She's been wanting nice teeth. She went through a lot with her teeth and um, she deserves it. My mom's a sweetheart as you might know. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> so she's flying in Wednesday. At the same time, my husband will be flying back to Pennsylvania. They are going to basically cross over. His plane touches down in the Harrisburg airport. My mom gets on that same plane and comes back to the Bradenton airport. So he won't have to leave me alone. If you didn't know, I don't do too well in the dark, just from some past traumas and issues. My disease is stable, which is doing great, which is why I'm able to do all of this fun stuff. But my husband probably wouldn't want to, at least he wouldn't feel comfortable leaving me alone for night after night or night. So this worked perfectly. My mom's gonna come stay. My husband's gonna go back to Pennsylvania to visit with some friends and family he hasn't seen. Okay, and print, do it. We can do it, print. Is that not printing either? What's up with these printers? There we go. <laughs> My um, printer is still low on toner. It keeps telling me that it's been telling me that forever, even though I fixed it. Whatever. Um, so that'll be this week. So my husband's been busy just readying the house, doing little things. Our house stays pretty clean anyway, since we don't have any animals nor children. And we're both fairly neat and organized people. Okay. Here we are, finally got a label. Now I am going to cut this label a little bit. It is on sticker paper. Here we are. And now I'm gonna put a sticker on the outside that says, thank you for supporting a small business. And it's got a gold foil to it. Thank you, Lisa. And I can reuse this other side. So we'll put that over here. Let's do another Brighton piece. Let's do the Silver Flower. Now this one also has a dust bag. So 
<laughs> and of course it just dumped out. There we go. So this one went for $17.50. I think that's what the other one went for. And it's headed to Brook, hi Brook. It's got a flower. One side has a rhinestone, the other does not. But they're very similar. Like I said, these Brighton pieces have just been doing really well. I'm gonna do the same thing with the turquoise box since it works so nicely. I wanna put the rhinestone on the right side, the correct side, just so you can see it. And we will cut a little bit of foam. Fold it up a little, stick it in there. And then back in the dust ruffle it goes. So Brooke lives in Colorado. She lives in the same town my sister and brother-in-law with their now 11-year-old daughter. Um, lived in Colorado for a year, maybe two years ago. And my sister loved it, it was beautiful, but she just missed family, which is totally understandable. Her and my mom have always been very close. And I would say my, my sister and I are also very close. <laughs> the other day I was looking for a text she wrote me and it was a very specific one to show my husband. So he's like, yeah, just plot your phone, grab the text. I'm like, okay. I'm like scrolling, scrolling. He's like, is that all in one day? I'm like, yeah, <laughs> my sister and I tend to text quite a bit, which is nice. Especially if we both have a little bit of time on our hands. I, because her life is fairly different than mine, she has, of course, a daughter where I don't. She has two adorable dogs. Her husband is a roofer. Um, she works with my mom, but she also has a landscaping business on the side, and her clients love her. So I just enjoy hearing what she's up to. It's funny that my mom and sister and my sister's family all live in Pennsylvania now because that's where my husband is from, and that's where we lived for 13 years. And then they moved there, and then we moved to Florida. <laughs> Sorry, girls. I would have loved to have been there with them, but our house was still about four hours away from where they moved. Look how pretty that is. Just the gold and this gold, so pretty. This was in the background of our videos, so I can't use too much because I'm gonna put it in the background. <laughs> but I figured it deserved to be used a little bit. I can always get another one to put in the background. And then all of the ribbon scraps are still going to my friend, Rhea. She has a channel. She just subscribed for Patreon, um, but her bag of scraps wasn't yet full. Right now I'm just setting them to the side. So I will probably send that off next month. I have some really cute package toppers. I found these at the Dollar Tree and there's three of them, okay, of course. Uh, you can do a chip clip. You can also, if you're showing clothing on a mannequin, you could use these to clip back um, the excess fabric. So I'm going to put that there. I thought they would make for pretty cute little additions. There we go. And I'm going to slip this one also into this, I almost called this cotton padded turquoise aqua, whatever color they're calling it. So light, I'm gonna say three ounces. It's very light. 2.4, so we round up to three ounces. An update 305, and she paid $3.99 for shipping, $17.50. Purchase and print. So with my mom coming in Wednesday and my husband leaving Wednesday, it just so happened that he got the only plane 
out <laughs> and back to Pennsylvania. So it just worked out perfectly. That was not planned up until about last week. He had the thought of doing it. And make sure this is gonna print. And worked perfectly. He's staying with some of our best friends and then he's staying at another best friend's house um, on the way back to the airport where he'll drop my mom's car back off. She'll fly in and grab her car. It, the, I think like, I think they should see each other at the Harrisburg airport. Pretty sure it's the same exact flight that he comes in on and she boards. So during the time of having her here, Wednesday, I'm sure we'll just hang out and chit chat. She, hopefully we can take a nap if she needs one. <laughs> if she needs one, my mom hardly ever needs a nap. Um, and then Thursday, she'll be gone for most of the day to her oral surgeon. And then Friday is her one day like completely off. So maybe the beach, maybe thrift shopping, whatever she wants to do. And if I'm good enough to do it, I always try to join her. I don't usually go to the beach for more than about an hour. So just again, depending on if she wants to be there the whole day or whatnot, I might, I might take a pass. We could hang out when she gets back. Thank you, Brooke. But we have some possibilities of hanging out today together, which is nice. Another great piece. Is it this one? Did the person pay for this one? We have a very heavy Brighton piece and I don't think the person paid for it yet. So I wanna check on that. Where are you? Here it is, they did not. Okay. So this is Donna. I want to make sure Donna didn't purchase anything else because that could be why she didn't pay for it if she's waiting for me for an invoice. Oh, another Donna. Okay, so we do have three purchases to a Donna, but they're all different Donnas. So I'm going to send the invoice for this piece, which was $24.99 plus $3.99 shipping. Do this Betsy Johnson. This is a larger piece. I found this in a Fred Up box. It was one of their fun boxes, and each piece works out to about two dollars. So I don't know what the rest of the box was, but this might have been the best piece. It might not have. Um, I'm gonna roll that a little bit. So uh, let's grab a little bit of tool to hold that in place. This had a bunch of viewers. I think I had it up for $29.99. Um, and I sent offers for $28.99. I kept getting offers back for like $12, $15, but I decided to hold out. I then um, cut back the price. So rather than keep sending people offers and send them offers and have them declined, I thought I might as well go ahead and just lower the price a little bit and then I don't have to throw out offers. It's just a thought. And sure enough, Jennifer came in and grabbed it at $26.99, which I think is a pretty good value. It's supposed to look like a burrito, like it's colored like a tortilla. And then there's a little hot pack, hot, hot sauce packet. And then um, the Betsy Johnson Gold Tone Hardware. So this is headed to California. She paid $26.99 plus $5.99 ship. So I wanna to try to get this under 16 ounces, if at all possible. Let's see. So, so far it's, so, so far it's almost 13 ounces. I wanna keep this well padded because there are some, some little bits and bobs that are a gold tone. if this sticker will work. I think it will. Now this is going to take a full sheet of paper. The papers are 20 by 30, which is a nice size for tissue paper because some other tissue papers are 16 by 20. I 
think for today, after my shipping, we'll see how I feel. Today I'm feeling great. Yesterday I did pretty well as, as well. I have some work times, but these last two days, I'll take them. normal for the start of summer here in Florida. We get rain almost every day in Florida summers, just a little bit in the evening usually, maybe an hour, maybe not even. It'll just come out of nowhere and pour. Okay, so let's grab, I know it's going to fit Miss Polly Miller. Let's put business cards on top. Let's see what kind of package topper will allow me to stay under 16 ounces. Ooh, I bet you I can do even a sheet mask. Let's see. Yes. So we'll probably be right at the 16 ounce mark, which is good because anything 16 ounces and under is first class now. Can you fit in here? Oh, I might need a bigger bag. Maybe not. I don't want to push it too hard, so we'll see. I think it's fitting fairly nicely. I round up to 16 ounces. Now 16 ounces, as you probably know, is one pound. But rather than put it one pound, I put it all under the ounces and put 16 ounces. Update eBay, $5.70. They paid $5.99 for shipping, so that was really close. Let's see if it was just, without the mask, it would have been 15 ounces. 15 ounces is $7.00. $5.70. So that one ounce upped it nothing. It upped it nothing. <laughs> so again, $5.70 headed to California to Jennifer. She should get this this week. Everybody today should be receiving their items this week. Open, print, and print. Later today, I will be editing the video try-on. If you didn't know, my neighbors have given me, give my husband actually, uh, over 12 vintage wedding dresses. I think most of them are probably from like the 70s, 80s. There might be one or two on the other side of those, those decades. But most of them are from the 70s, 80s, and they were so much fun. What does this say? Jam. You have a jam. They were so much fun to try on. Where's your jam? Oh, I see you. I can pull it out in one. I'm switch. Nope. I'll be back. be editing that video of me trying on all those wedding dresses a few absolutely would not go past my hips but most of them I was able to to get on it at least a little bit you know what I 
I should be doing. We've had a few people send us cards, so I, I will be opening those. out um, this label before I forget though okay so to print another label if it doesn't already do that on the left hand column underneath my eBay there's shipping labels under sell if you hit shipping labels it pulls up eventually your list of labels the list of labels I need is here the last label I can just hit reprint and open and print and print. Let's see if it actually does it this time. Jennifer. We will take a quick break to read some of the mail that you have sent me. This letter came in from Vivian in May. We have a little pamphlet here. Hi there, how are you and your family doing during these? challenging times. Her script is beautiful. Um, my name is Vivian. I saw you on your videos. She enjoyed the video. Thanks, Vivian. Just wanted to let you know, I also share with you all of the from Vivian. She loves watching me. Thank you, Vivian. I wanted to pass along this pamphlet. I went to Bible college. Um, I was very much into sharing. I don't know if I want to do this on this. The first letter was from Vivian. Vivian, thank you so much. I will be writing you back directly as this was more of a personal matter. And I don't necessarily know if you want this on here. So I will write back. The next is a package. And I know we have another package down at our PO box. But with Bear being out of work, um, restaurants we just heard are starting to book entertainment. So I'm sure he'll be working sooner than not, but um, he's a musician at Retirement Communities. Retirement Communities rock. I'm telling you, the people that work there, oh, we used to manage Retirement Communities, four of them in fact, over the years. And it's something I love to do. It's just a lot of physicality. I, what is this? This is beautiful. Forget it, forget the other story. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh my goodness, this is so much fun. Julie, Julie, you didn't have to do that. But you know what, I should save this, I can send it. Okay, I'm opening this first. Only washed, never worn. Oh, pretty, oh my goodness. This reminds me of the Jilson paper the wildflowers, very pretty, very soft. I'm wondering if this is like a polyester cotton, 100% cotton. It has that very, uh, not a brushed feel. It's beautiful, thank you so much. 
let's let's open another one. I don't know what this is. Wear them only two times then washed. Thank you. Is this a swimsuit? It is. E L O I M E L O M I size US 18. This looks really well made. Love the color. Oh, it's a watermelon. Oh my goodness, that's so cute. <gasps> Thank you. Such fun prints too. I'm keeping these bags. Okay. Oh, a pillow planner. You know, I don't have one of these. So I'm opening this because <laughs> Bear will use this or I will use this. Bear right now has um, more vitamins than pills, but I make them up in two inch, two inch, two ounce Dixie cups, like what you would normally use for jello shots. That's what Amazon said at least. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had a jello shot. I don't particularly like jello. Oh, these are nice. It's a nice one. Thank you. Seriously, that's such a practical item. We will definitely be getting some use out of that. Thanks, Julie. We have, oh, this is so pretty. Paper mark. I know this ribbon is pricey. I might just switch over it today. <laughs> we have a print that matches it perfectly, so. Good, now I can put back that other ribbon. This is like a periwinkle blue, I would say. Maybe a light blue. Really pretty, nice quality. Thank you. And she sent me some jewelry. Oh, this feels really nice. So a collar. They're all done in the same metals too. Is it a set? Earrings, these are earrings. With this heart locket, a crown, and like a crest, a family crest. This has the same one. I've never seen earrings like this. Let's see if I can put something behind them so you can see them. They're a nice size and a nice weight. Then we have a matching watch, bracelet, not sure. Ooh, oh, I have sold something like this and it sold well. It has a coin on the front of 1907. I don't know if it's a real coin. How did I get these on last time? I've never sold one with a coin on top of it. Oh, I think it just goes like that. Okay, so easier than expected. Beautiful. Love this set. And then the last piece is something with links. A nice gold tone. Again, feels really nice. Looks brand new. You could put some charms on that or just leave it as is. Really pretty. Thank you, Julie. I have just finished photographing everything I have. So this will be my next photographing session. Up. In so I don't lose anything. And there's still more. Oh, here's the letter. Hi, Melissa and Bear. Feel free to use, sell, or donate any of the items. Thanks, Julie. Hugs, Julie. Love your YouTube channel and your mom's too. Thank you. I will tell my mom as she is coming in just a few days. Let's do this one first. I think this is purple tissue paper. It is. It's nicely saturated too. So pretty. And then we have a whole bunch more. So 
Sharpies. I love Sharpies. These are such fun colors, the pink and the green, kind of Lily Pulitzer colors. Very spring-like. We then have a microscope. Nice. So I can see markings on jewelry, I'm sure. Here's the instructions. Oh my goodness, it's adorable. It's the perfect size. Oh yeah. I need something with a marking. Do you have a marking? Ah, thank you. I'm gonna put those back in and I'll have to read the instructions on how to professionally use this. It's very sweet. Oh, I was just going to order something like these. These are Chevron, the Chevron ones I was gonna order, um, like paper bags to slip things in. That's so funny, I didn't. And the only reason I didn't is because I couldn't hit the minimum on the website or I would have had to pay like $5.99 shipping. Some satin ribbons, microscope. Oh, a whole bunch of drawstring bags. This is so much. <gasps> That was so sweet. Some light blue ribbon. Some stickers. Oh, oh, oh. Opening this right up. This looks to be a vintage. I don't want to give this away. <laughs> vintage flamingos on a card. Oh, it's so pretty. You know what I think I'm going to do with this? One of my Patreon members um, lives in Florida and loves flamingos. So I might pass that along to them as I know they would love that. Oh, and Holly Mellers. I have never seen either one of these colors. Bright yellow and like a wine burgundy pink. Thank you so much, Julie. That was, that was so nice of you. Please don't feel like you ever have to do that. Thank you for doing it. Okay, all this back in here. Set that right there. Make sure I keep the cards with it. nice little break from packaging. The next item is a Brighton piece. It has, it's a long piece and can be doubled easily. It has a gold tone link with silver tone ovals and diamonds and then some really pretty beads that catch the light really, really nicely. There's like an AB polish on them. And it came in this fun bag. So let's hit print the label. I also have gold, where did my gold ones go? Oh, here they are. Maybe I'll do this one in gold since it's so long. Should I go once round maybe? I don't think this is something that would necessarily tangle, but I wanna keep it as detangled as possible, so. I think I'm just gonna go once around and keep doing that. Oh yeah, that'll work. Okay, so that's what that'll look like. But of course we are going to put a little bit more foam on top of that. There's so many things that we use throughout the house that were gifted to us. <laughs> so thank you so much. Okay, obviously that won't fit now, so we'll just tie that on top with our new satin ribbon. Just one of those once around. to Maryland in South Dakota. I'm going to use the other paper I brought out. 
I put this in some of the 4th of July boxes that I sent out this past week for Patreon. I wanted to get red, white, and blue theme without having like only things you can use during the patriotic time. So like anything with reds or blues, like this. But you could also use this September. You could use this throughout the year and nobody's going to think like, wow, that's overly patriotic. That was the thought for that theme. We started to collect themes into now 2021. I think all of our Patreon spots are sold out. I probably will open some back up after my mom leaves. Let me stick this on and we are going to hit pause because I hear my husband is awake. Hey, husband. Hi. I'll be back. Okay, we're back. I don't think I pressed the button. I picked this light blue ribbon, which was just sent to me. This has some really pretty light blues in it that match perfectly. And we'll throw one of each business card. There we go. And I think this will still fit in this little mailer. Let's see how many we can fit in here. Like I said, these were 10 cents. Holly Mallers are slightly cheaper, but with the jewelry, it's nice to have a little extra padding. It is 4.4 ounces, so we round up to five. Not 34 pounds, which somehow put itself in there. So five ounces from me to South Dakota. She paid $13.50 for the brace, the necklace. $3.99 for shipping, and my cost for shipping was $3.39. Purchase and print. So my store's gonna be off for just over a week this time, which is absolutely fine. Print and print. I've shown you these stickers. These say pretty things inside. I got them on Amazon as I get most of my stickers on Amazon at this point. One of those on the outside. Does everybody have a sticker? You need a sticker? You have a sticker, but we can give you another sticker. And if you have one, but we'll put one on the back as well. Oh, and that needs a label. <laughs> Don't mail something without a label. Let's grab that sheet. Thanks, Marilyn. We have 13 left. Let's do this lucky bracelet. That's what I thought I did pull it. This was one of those pieces out of the thread up box. I think everything here is. It has a decent weight to it. One of my other members asked me because she was looking for something lightweight. This would not be. This feels feels substantial. It's really pretty. It has the lucky branding and I put it up for auction. Eileen, hi Eileen, says, hi Melissa, I'm so happy to have won this. You had mentioned me in one of the videos about wrapping an item. However, I missed it. <laughs> I must have said something like, Sorry, Eileen, Mary, and Joe, I can't wrap your items, but I, I sometimes do that if I'm winding down. I sincerely hope you will be showing this in your next shipping video, which I am. Say hello to your hubby. I would scream it, but he'll know. I'll tell him later. So this sold for $12.50, and she 
I don't think we have a box that's gonna fit this. And she paid $3.99 for shipping. So we're gonna wrap that with some foam since we don't have a box. Jam it in there. Nice. Now, because we don't have a box, I can do a few things. I could obviously just wrap it. I could, I thought I had some of those little, no, I don't have any of those either. It looks like we're just going to wrap it. I don't know if it'll even fit in this. Hmm, it won't fit in one of these. wondering if it was going to fit in one of the ones Julie sent me, but I don't think it is either. So let's just go ahead and wrap it with some tissue. I think it'll be fine in the, I was going to say wash, in the mail, as it has the padding, and we will put the padding over it as well. I'm going to use a full piece. instead of tape. I'm appreciating the ease of the stickers. I'm sure it's slightly more, but love it. Let's go with our new ribbon. Oh, that looks really pretty too against this. I cut this way too big. Gonna have some nice big loops on her bow. I was telling my husband the next step of getting the house clean is probably to wash down all of the walls in the kitchen and the outside and inside of the refrigerator. It's like I did it yesterday. Okay, yay. Okay, we'll put some business cards under there. And will it fit in here? I think it will. Let's do the royal jelly mask. It doesn't fit in here. I have some regular poly mallers, especially now with the bright yellow ones and the kind of pinkish maroon ones. But I think this will fit. Yep, perfectly fine. I'm sure the mail carrier will be thrilled um, to have such little mail to pick up tomorrow. <laughs> the weight is 4.1, so I round up to five. This past week, we had 70 subscription packages go out, so 70 huge bags, and each bag was about four to six pounds each. So um, there's a lot of mail we picked up. My cost is $3.31, purchase and print. And Eileen is in Maryland, so she should get this probably within two or three days. Open, print, and print. We'll read another card while my printer is printing. This is from Barbara. I see confetti. Oh, so fun. <laughs> oh, it's butterfly confetti. Oh, that's perfect. I sold um, a butterfly something. I'll show you later. Okay, it says, Dear Melissa and Bear, thank you for all you do for all of us. You are a very special, unique, and caring couple who gives so much. We appreciate you. Hugs and love, Barbara. Thank you so much, Barbara. As you know, all of the cards and letters that are sent to me are kept in a special binder. And I go through it every once in a while and read everybody's. And we have another paper jam. What's up with paper jams, man? I think what I 
gets to the regular printer paper, it's not reading as thick enough, maybe? Maybe I have to set to a thicker setting, so just have to keep, I'm going to save this confetti. Um, I just have to keep it on a thicker paper setting for the labels. So let's try that again. opening up the back door. a four by six printer and I'm printing it on my regular printer so here we are put the pretty things inside the label thank you Elaine let's see what's next ship your next item let's do a lot of earrings. I think this is it. It is. So this was 17 earrings, just a whole bunch of costume jewelry earrings. And Norma purchased these from New York. I'll pull out a couple. And she paid $9.99. I put these on auction. Some really pretty sparkly ones, some hoops, some studs. Now what I usually do for these, I'm not gonna go through and put every single earring on a card. What I will do though, is include some extra cards for her. So I have all of these, they're just all over the place, um, cards that have the earring punch outs. So I'll include a bunch of these for her in case she's selling them, in case she just wants to organize them for her. And I will be including a whole bunch of extra earring backs. One of my um, subscribers sent me earring backs and I picked up some from Amazon. These are very inexpensive. So I'm just gonna toss them in there. And that way if she needs a little bit more security, I think all of these had their backs, but never know. Never know when you're gonna lose one. So there we go wrap that up with some tissue. I don't think it needs a double piece of tissue. So we're going to cut. Oh, maybe it does. Never mind. It's going to say we're going to cut it in half. No, we won't. of 
earrings. That was a pretty good deal. Now shipping was $4.99, but still that's under a dollar an earring, and some of them were brand new. And even if she only uses about half of them or then donates and gives away or whatever she's going to do, the extras. It's a very economical way of, of buying earrings. And they're easier for me, for me to ship and list as well. Here we are. I don't think this is going to fit. Never mind. I take that back. That fit fine. Even with a mask, that fit well. Let's give it away. I'm going to say 13 ounces. 10 ounces exactly, so there's no need to round up. Update. Uh, my cost is $4.18, and again, she paid $9.99, Norma in New York, and her shipping was $4.99. So I make a little bit in shipping. Open and paste and print. I think I'm going to try the 2x7, the Dymo 450 in the next one. I heard sellers saying yesterday and the day before that shipping, you couldn't do shipping. Some people just had no options for shipping and they thought it was Dymo, but it's not. It turned out to be eBay. So always feel free to write me. Um, I check my email every day throughout the day and if it's I get a lot of emails and thank you for that it's not a big deal but I always try to get back to the people who really need help immediately so if I see your email and it's something that just says like thank you and there's no need to reply immediately please know I'll get back to it but maybe not just in the, the first day or two okay here we go Norma sticker on there. Thank you, Norma. I'm running over a wire. Let's pick that up. Okay, and the next person. Who's gonna be next? Should we do another lot? I think Paul ordered these. And it's the only Paul, so let's do another lot of earrings. lots of earrings, lots of bracelets, lots of necklaces in their own separate box. So I just wrote down colorful lot of earrings and then I got to the box and I had two colorful lots of earrings. So I have to see which one it is. It is this one, right? Is it this one? Is it not this one? <laughs> I don't think I pulled either one of them. That's his there must be another lot of earrings. I'll be right back. Well, that was easy enough. Here they are. <laughs> there were three lots in there. So again, I am going to put a whole bunch of cards and we'll open this up and stick some extra backs in there. And this is going to, they left a note, Cheryl. Love watching your videos and buying all this gorgeous jewelry. Thanks, Cheryl. I will be send, sending you a little something soon in the mail. You don't have to do that, but thank you very much. I hope you are feeling good today. I am having a really good day. I don't know if it's because I've gotten a little bit more sleep. I, I have no idea. There's really sometimes, sometimes I can track it and be like, oh, I shouldn't have had that cough drop or whatever it was, but sometimes there's just no rhyme or reason. Sometimes it takes medicine really well, and today's one of those days, medicine is absolutely helping. I would say on a scale of my pain whispering to yelling, it's a faint whisper. It's doing really well today. We are gonna take it because I have bunches of stuff I can do, and I wanna do it all. So let's wrap this. Earrings need a little bit more protection sometimes because of the posts. Come on, come on. And we will wrap that up. My husband is off to 
to wash the inside of the car. And just the inside because with the summer rains, there's really no point in washing the outside. And he just did that 4,000 times last week. That's nothing that you. You're going to wash the car? Clean out the inside. Clean out the inside? Yes. Okay. Do you have sunscreen on? No. Would you like sunscreen on? No. Do you have something to drink? Yes. Okay. I love you. over and I think we should be able to fit this as well oh yeah everybody's fine today in one of these just good when these came I think I told you this before the boxes were over my head because I ordered a thousand of them but for some reason my head a thousand of these were not boxes over my head so we've got those all incorporated now thankfully into the house these are eight ounces, 7.2 rounds up to eight. So she paid $9 for earrings and $4.99 for shipping. Update, my shipping cost is $3.52, purchase and print. Look at all this extra ribbon so far. I have my extra ribbon bin um, in the lanai. I didn't bring it over, but it's over there. Print and print. And while that is printing and taking its good old time, I will move on to my next item, which I think is an Alex and Ani bracelet. I have two Alex and Ani bracelets that have sold. One through eBay and one just to a friend, an internet friend. But I think I pulled both of them. There we go. Thank you, Cheryl. So, Alex and Ani bracelet. There's the other one. So this is an eternity swirls, eternity, it's like an infinity sign. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. This cleaned up pretty nicely using the sterling silver wipes. Somebody wrote me and told me that Alex and Ani specifically makes a cloth. And now I'm going to Google it. Alex and Ani cloth, like a cleansing cloth. A best-selling option is Swiffer Sweeper Wet Mop and Cloth Multi-Surface Refills. Alexa. 36. Stop. Why? Why? Okay, so how much is the cloth? It's $6, so not bad if I was buying something on Alex and Ani. I'm not. So let's go to eBay. Let's check my feedback on there. All positive. The last one says, wow, I didn't think this ring would fit, but it does. Love, <laughs> love beautiful pieces to wear and add to my gift collection. Thanks so much, Melissa. Melissa, you are the best, beautiful packaging. My favorite seller ever. So sweet. She left me two full pages. The nicest packaging I've ever received. Wow, that's so sweet. These are stunning, best seller ever. Great transaction, better than expected. Love the packaging. Excellent, perfect, bestseller ever. Love seeing that in the feedback. Occasionally I do get a neutral or a negative. I do usually ask that the person remove it if I feel like it's not warranted um, or I've already corrected it in somehow, and they usually do. Once in a great while, I have to call eBay regarding the feedback, and I have had great luck with that, that eBay looks into 
my correspondence with the people and they agree that I should not have been left a feedback. So no promises that I'll always have 100% feedback and I know I won't because we live in a flawed world, but for right now I'm enjoying it. So I was checking for an Alex and Ani cloth on eBay. Let's go to the lowest. There's only 12. So here it is. $4.99 and $3 shipping. That's not bad. I'm going to put that in my watch list. And then if the person wants to send me an offer, they can. I would probably, I sell enough Alex and Ani that I'd be curious how it worked. And if it worked better than the sterling silver bracelet um, cleaner that I use, I'd be interested. Okay, so I don't think this is gonna fit in there, but I do have these bigger boxes now. So I'm gonna put this in here. That'll look nice. Stick it all in. Good. And let's cut apart this mint that I'm just digging with my husband and I making up 70 subscription boxes of packing supplies every month now. I'm going through over 1,200 pieces of tissue paper a month. 1,200 pieces of tissue paper I'm going through in one month. So the order I just placed in February for about 10,000 sheets. I still have about half but I needed to place another order. So I did that this past, um, this past week. So we have plenty more tissue paper coming. We've, we've grown Patreon from probably, last year we had, I don't know, maybe we were shipping out 10 subscription boxes, maybe. And I kept raising it and raising it. You can, you know, do a minimum of 10 or I don't want to do too many past 20. So as we get more comfortable every month with knowing how much supplies I need, how much time it's going to take, how to do that properly, um, we've been increasing. And now we're at 70 and I think we're going to leave it around that for a couple months to see if we can. It took us three days this past this past month in June, but we don't have any extra boxes. Sometimes I'll make extra boxes just in case an order comes in late. So if I open up any more, I'm gonna have to make some extra boxes, but it's great fun. I love choosing the prints and putting the whole thing together. I'll link one of my Patreon members, Barb, um, below. I'll try to link her in the top. If you just type in Melissa with two L's, Patreon. Um, hers is the second and third. So if you do, let's see how to get June Patreon Melissa. No, that won't do it. Can you just type in her name? Barbie Girl Thrifter, I think she is. Yes. Barbie girl is one word. So Barbie girl and then the word thrifter. So if you type that into the search, um, her unpackaging the Patreon boxes will be shown. So you can see what people are getting. Okay, let's open up a mask pack. These are a cucumber. I did just order another 600 masks. The cheapest I can find them are about 38 cents. Um, I've looked on AliExpress, on Wish, and they're about the same price, the cheapest ones. And these have really good reviews, and I use these for my own face. I love these. I feel like they're hydrating without being too um, abrasive. Three ounces, exactly. Three ounces. So this is headed to, oh, pretty name. Eliath, E-L-I-E-T-H. Eliath, maybe, or Eliath in California. Beautiful name. She paid $3.99 for the bracelet and $3.99 shipping. My cost for shipping to California is $3.18. So 
So let's go ahead and purchase and print. So Barbie Girl Thrifter has opened April, May, and June's on film. I'm usually about a month ahead, so the June package had like a patriotic feel. But again, most of the supplies you could use year round. So if you don't have enough sales, hopefully you have a lot of sales, but if you don't have enough one month or you go on vacation, you're not gonna waste those supplies. You can use most of the supplies year round. I think next month is either going to be a cactus like green theme or like treats and edible concoctions like macaroons and donuts and ice creams and stuff like that like sweet treats i have both so it just depends on how i'm feeling next month okay let's do a little trimming here thank you elliot or elias and thank you for supporting my small business. Okay, next item I think is a long navy necklace. This is going to Nancy. Did Nancy order anything else? No. So Nancy has a dark blue 30 inch strand. These are like a dark, um, blue hard plastic and it's 30 inches can you wear it doubled i think you can yes i would see most people would be able to double that but she might want to keep it long let's see if it fits in this gold box spiral it around rather nicely. I'm going to stop and change my battery and I'm back. Brushed my hair, brushed my teeth, ate something, grabbed some Fruit Loops lip balm. My, one of my family's friends, no, one of my friends daughters, Jessica, one of my friends, has a company now on Etsy and she makes these amazing lip balms. Even the packaging is pretty. Uh, Jessica's lip balm.co. They're $3 a piece. I love the taste. Like, they taste so good. This one exactly tastes like Fruit Loops. She nailed it. Okay, now let's put a layer around this. That'll keep the lid on. And let's put a sticker. Pretty things inside to hold all of that. So this is going, who did I say this is going to? Sometimes when I take any kind of break, um, I forget, I have to get back in the swing of things. I'm sure we're all like that in some ways. So Nancy in Massachusetts. M-A. Pretty sure it's Massachusetts. Mm, love this. I like the, the purple lollipop too. I've tried the purple lollipop, purple grape, grape lollipop. And I'm not even a huge grape fan. They just all taste delicious. And my husband snagged the peanut butter chocolate cup chocolate peanut butter cup. I don't know. They're so good. I've tried to make chopstick for my own personal use because I thought it would be cheaper and that way I could give it away in package toppers in the winter time. Oh my goodness. It's a lot harder than I thought. <laughs> I had like very, there were just parts where it didn't blend. Maybe my blender doesn't work as well as I thought it did. There's like a gloppy and oh, it's just a mess. This is so smooth. So nice. Plus it's delicious. Have I mentioned it's delicious? Okay. And let's do the coconut. 
coconut, cucumber, that's what that is. Do I have any more of those aqua mailers or do I have to go get more? I think I have to go get more. I will be, be back. We will be back. Okay. I would love to step outside today. It's slightly windy, but it looks nice overall. We've been having those summer storms, as I've said, and we had rain yesterday all day and then the day before, so I haven't been outside in a few days. 5.1, so we round up to six for Nancy in Massachusetts. She paid $3.99 with $4.49 shipping. My cost for shipping is $3.39. Purchase and print open print and print the next one remind me um somebody remind me and i'll try that for excel again to see if that decided to start working if not no big deal but i do want to try all of my label makers each time I'm doing a little cleaning, getting rid of what I've shipped off of my sold list. Thank you, Nancy. on what it is. Some of these costume pieces I know are going to a very specific audience. So this one I dropped the price down to $3.99 which is kind of my lowest price I'll go. I might go $2.99 maybe but I don't have the intention usually of just starting something out at $2.99 but I'll make a couple dollars even if something sells for $3.99. So $3.99 and $3.99 shipping. This has two strands of a kind of distressed metal. The heart, it has very scrolled look. There's a little purse and then a little skeleton key. Now the way the metal is made, it's going to do that kind of blue patina. You can see that kind of starting out at the heart. So I liked it. I did not clean that because it just gives it kind of that unique quality that I like. And obviously so did Linda. So she paid $3.99 for the necklace and $3.99 for shipping. Got a little piece of foam. That piece had, had a piece of packaging tape on it, so I wouldn't have been able to use that one, but this one will work perfectly. And I'm going to slip it into one of these. Cute, cute. Cut up some more tissue paper. Most of what I'm selling lately is jewelry. I haven't been to the Goodwill bin since February. And although I would love to go back, I don't necessarily need to do that right now. I've got plenty of inventory here at the house. And with my mom coming, 
Um, my husband cut his finger and needed nine stitches this past week. Uh, I have three doctor's appointments, two of which are online, thankfully, but my lidocaine appointment obviously can't be done through the computer. And during the time my mom is coming, my husband is leaving, so we're setting him up. He's only taking one small bag, so he doesn't have to pay extra. And again, he's staying with a friend, so if he really needed to borrow something, he could. But all of that happening at once. So we will go back to thrifting. Maybe not this month, but maybe soon. I do miss seeing things at the bin. That's where I get my household items or just package toppers. But again, I've found some wonderful things like the masks that can be purchased in lots of 200 and aren't too pricey for me. There we go. I wish my sister was coming with my mom. I know she can't, but I haven't seen her since October and I would love to see her again. We chit chat on the phone every day though, so. Hi, cute, cute. And the Aquamella. I feel so color coordinated today because everything is like the same hue. Let's say four. 1.8, that wasn't even close. Little sticker for the back. So we'll round up to two. Two ounces headed to WI. Is that Wisconsin? WI state abbreviation. What else could it be? Wisconsin. Okay. Yeah, I don't think it could have really been too much other than that. Okay, so she paid $3.99 and $3.99. My cost is $2.93. So from that $2.93, we're about a dollar away from what she paid. She overpaid by a dollar. So that will take care of the mask. I did give her a mask, didn't I? Uh-oh. Nope. Good thing I checked that. I'll recheck the weight too. So now that I've opened this, I'm just going to take the top. Just gonna put that right over there. And I will recheck. The, um, this might have bumped it up to three ounces. It did, it's 2.8. So what I'm going to do is not print this. I'm going to go to my eBay main page, just my myebay.com and scroll down, same, same column, go under sell, under shipping labels. Her shipping label will be at the top I then drop down to more actions under hers and hit void. Select reason. You really could put anything. Changed mind, label lost, label didn't print, transaction canceled, problem with the label, other. I'm just gonna put other. Okay, so I'll get that money back in a day or two. And I'm going to reprint her label. Can I do that? I know I can. Okay, so I need to go ahead and print a second label. Let's click into the item. When I click into the item and I'm looking at it just like I'm a buyer, there at the top is print another label. And that's what I'm gonna do. This time I'm gonna round up to three ounces and my cost is still $2.93. Doesn't matter. I would rather do it the right way than the wrong way and have the customer unhappy. So with the dollar I've made in shipping, that will go towards my packaging materials. 
It will go toward eBay fees. I pay taxes on these items. So don't feel like that $1 is all profit, it is not. In fact, most of it is not profit, which is fine. I set my own prices. I'm happy for large sales and small sales. And you'll see the next one, perfect example of a large sale. Linda. Okay, the next item is a Thomas Sabo, Sabo necklace. This sold within a week or so. It is sterling silver. It is marked. And silver on the back. And then if I flip it over, come on, flip, flip, flip. It's a black faucetted, faceted something. I don't know what it is. I titled this Thomas Sabo, because that's what was written on it, 0.25 sterling silver necklace, black faceted, oval pendant on chain. So that's how I titled that. Let's put it in a box. And again, I'm gonna want to put a little bit of foam. always want the presentation better than expected. So there we go. And let's put this, slide it right in here. And then I'll wrap everything. So she paid $49.99 for the necklace and $4.49 for the shipping. And this is headed to Donna. Donna, I recognize you, of course, and you are in New Mexico. piece of tissue. This is such a pretty piece and I could tell right away that it was something. I don't know if you've been watching my um, thread up unboxing. So I unbox the, the jewelry box, the mystery boxes, and then usually within a week or two, I have them listed. And then a week or two later, you'll see some start to pop up on these videos where I'm shipping things. I'm going to do some tool on this one. It's always fun to, to see the journey and where things end up. This piece absolutely paid for that whole box though, because the whole box was $34. And even after fees and everything, I should still make about $35 in profit. Okay, I'm gonna use the you are enough. in an aqua mailer. This reminds me of the thread up packaging a little bit. They have bright turquoise, I would call them turquoise rather than aqua, polka dots on everything. So their boxes and their tissue paper and all of their branding materials look very similar. Okay, 1.8, so we round up to two. Um, update. So Donna in New Mexico paid $4.49 and my cost is three, just three oh five. Wow. Okay. And she should get this probably, I'm going to say Tuesday or Wednesday. I wonder how the weather is out in New Mexico. New Mexico is such a beautiful state and areas. Print. Our wind just kicked up there. I see you. Hopefully my mom will want to go to the pool. 
Bear and I went to the pool the other day, but it was a little too windy to be there just soaking nicely. He's a little bit more of a baby than I am. <laughs> He's okay to see. Donna. I'm having such a lovely time. Next is Sandra. Sandra ordered two items. The first is a stacking lot of bracelets. So one, two, three. And the other one is the magnetic bracelet. So the first look like these. They're a little bit malleable. Um, they have such a luxury look to them. Like if I saw these in a boutique shop in Florida, I really would have thought these were 50, 60, 75 dollars. Very nice looking. They feel nice. I sold them for I think 10 dollars. I can only see. $10 and then I sold this magnetic piece for $5. This has a nice weight to it. I love magnets. Okay, so there's two, three, four, five, five strands. Get out of there. Um, done in all kinds of purples, some light purples. They probably are just coming off like black, but they're actually really pretty. Some are really light, some are darker. And easy as that. The magnet class kind of locks in place, unless you know what you're doing. So that's really nice. So let's put these in some boxes for her. There we go, keep this protected. either one, but I think I'm going to put it in this one as well. There we are. Let's do, let's do just one piece to keep these together. Yeah, that'll fit nicely. And did I say who these were going to? Sandra. I recognize Sandra, of course. She paid twice for shipping, so I have already refunded her her extra shipping. That happens sometimes. People ask me to wait to package their items until it's on film, which I don't mind doing at all, as long as eBay is okay with it. Uh, let's do tissue next. Let's do the this tissue. Sandra has purchased from me probably several dozen times and is in New York. So for people that have purchased from me quite often, I like to try, I like to try, I can't always do it, to include like poppers that are kind of new to me. So she's going to get some of those cats, dogs, whatever those were called. Because I know those were brand new for me this week. I found them at the Dollar Tree, but they seem to work really well. Okay. There we go. I need these nice and long. Let's see. Do we do cats or dogs? I think I'm going to do the lemon yellow one because it kind of matches a little. How cute that is. <laughs> and we will do my business card behind it. Now because this now has an extra piece, I am going to use some more bubble 
foam wrap. Just to try to keep this safe. one sheet should be able to hold it. They are okay, but they're not completely gloss, but they're not completely matte. Very nice. The look of them is beautiful. I'd be interested in knowing where you got these. I like the feel of these a lot. This feels a little bit different than the normal polymers. Plus, if packages ever go missing, it's so easy to tell the mail carrier, like, oh, it's the bright yellow package, or, oh, the aqua bubble mailer. It's nice. Eight. So zero pounds, eight ounces. Update. Sandra is in New York. My cost is three thirty-nine. And while eBay is thinking about that, I'm gonna go. I apologize. I don't know if you saw me wrap um, Sandra's. I looked up and my phone was just completely. Uh, my camera was completely out. So the next piece is headed to Melinda. It's a Southwestern necklace, faux turquoise inlay, beads, silver tone, 20 inches. So that's how I titled it. And it was up for about a week. Melissa, Melinda is in Texas. I know this Melinda. Hi, Melinda. And I don't think we're going to be able to fit it even in a big box, but let me check that out. Well, I take that back. I think that's going to fit. A piece of paper or any kind of wax as I'm lazy and I don't see any more foam here. <laughs> I'm just gonna cut this up and use it as some bubble wrap. That way we can get this properly sealed. There we go. That way it won't scratch it. And we'll do that around the package as well. And just use a sticker to hold that in place. So there's that, what that looks like with the gold. Now let's open up. The tissue paper. For $19.99, like I said, probably about a week of having my shop open. Um, $4.99 shipping. It is headed to Melinda, and Melinda lives in Texas. If this is the right Melinda, Melinda has been a fan of mine, wow, years and years. <laughs> Melinda, I think I'm trying to remember how we first met. I think I purchased Isogenics, which is like a dietary supplement. And I was selling it and you questioned it. And then we got to be kind of good friends through that. If, if I'm remembering correctly, which who knows if I am. And you've been with me since then, so thank you. That's so sweet. There we go. And I'm going to put it in the yellow mailer again. Okay. I want to make sure. I don't know if this one had the, um, an extra. Oh, it did. It does have it. Okay. 
So this is 6.5, so we round up to 7. Up to 8. My cost is $3.31 for shipping, purchase, and print label. I bought my mom some new business cards, so I'm excited to think, see what she thinks of them. Print and print. They're nothing like super high-end designer, but they're her style and I think she'll very much like them. And they're just a small gift. There's something like mine that has her saying, but she could pass them out at a store. There's some room where she can write her phone number. Let's see, she comes across a woman who has all bluefish on or all St. John on, and she recognizes that. I was like, I buy clothing. If you'd ever be willing to donate some clothing or have me look at your clothing, um, I might be able to split the profits or come up with a little thing to say beforehand and you can give a card out in that circumstance. I remember seeing my first blue fish dress in the wild and I was still so shy. I was in my early 20s. I was um, doing some promotional modeling in the city of Pittsburgh and they gave me a Vespa to drive around and I was driving the Vespa and I stopped and everybody's like, why are you stopping? We're in like a big crowd. And I was like, that girl is wearing bluefish. <laughs> Nobody knew what bluefish was. I'm shocked I did. And I went over and talked to her and I said, I really appreciate that you're wearing bluefish. And she was surprised that I was surprised that I recognized it. It went well. I didn't buy her dress. Next is a sterling silver St. Christopher pendant and chain and this is headed to Carol. Okay, I'm a liar. I know I pulled it, but it's not in there. So let's go to the next item. We'll find that some other time. So next we are at Susan. Susan has five items. She has this. Uh, both of these? Yes. And this. Yes. So she has this um, kind of hammered. It feels really substantial and nice. It's a gold tone, bronze, brass tone, cuff bracelet. Uh, I think for this she paid $6.99? four ninety nine. dollars and she picked up both sets of earrings, which I thought she would. She picked up the leaves. They're so pretty. And the other side is like a painted maker's mark. And these were $6.99. And then she picked up the little tinkling bells. And the bells were $8.50. They had four bits on them. And the last thing she picked up was this piece of sea glass, real piece of sea glass, I believe, not sure, with some real stones. And this has a toggle closure as a bracelet. Uh, not full toggle, I take that back. Partial toggle. And this sold for $9.99. So I want to use those little cards for these. makes a nicer presentation. It's one set. The leaves will be two sets. You hear the wind? It keeps picking up and picking up. And let's do this bracelet in here. And then this one, I don't think it's going to fit in any of them. So I'm just going to put this in a blue chiffon bag. Come on, blue chiffon bag. <laughs> I know you fit this. I know you do. Maybe it doesn't. There we are. And we'll put this in a blue chiffon bag. Everybody gets a blue chiffon bag. Two more to go. Susan buys from me probably every other week. 
So she's one of those ones who kind of knows um, when I get new package toppers. So let's put this in some foam. I think I'm out of foam here, but I've got plenty more in my room. I actually got some bubble wrap. My husband's coming back inside. This is the kind of bubble wrap that kind of sticks to itself, which is so nice. And then we will wrap this with tissue paper. some of the greens. go through and make sure we refund her for all of the extra shipping. So we'll use the new business cards, of course, of course. And I think I'm going to give her one of those, um, it'd be a gray looks like it could be a dog or a bear. It's cute. There we are. Let's put it in the yellow mallard. Ah, let's do the pinkish one. to hit print shipping label. 5.5 gets rounded up to six. So she purchased just the butterfly earrings for $6.99 and $3.99 shipping. My cost for shipping everything is $3.39. So the butterfly earrings more than covered the cost for shipping all of it. Okay, open and print. And print. So what I have to do next is I have to copy that transaction number, that tracking number, and put it on every other item she did. So I'm going to copy that number. And then paste it for her other three items. Add tracking number. Uh, tracking number and the last one a uh, tracking number so that way eBay knows that I sent these all in one package and the tracking numbers are attached individually so that way if they see one is missing they can just check the tracking oh yeah it's shipped together we're good to go we had no issues for that I'm going to go ahead and refresh the page just to make sure they all now have that tracking number attached and they do one last thing I want to do for this package is go to PayPal because she paid $11.97 in shipping and $3.99 in shipping and we only needed to use that $3.99 so I think I already refunded her but I want to make sure so I go to view all and type in Susan. Here she is. And I did refund her the rest of her shipping. So we are in a good place to go ahead and delete 
anything that I have previously packaged. So I could delete the Tom Sabo, I could delete the heart, the purse, I can delete the stacking bangles and the Navajo piece. And I can attach this now onto Susan's package. Thanks, Susan. Okay, so we have how many more to go? One person hasn't paid. We have one, two, three people with uh, one person has two. So four items total. I will be back shortly. The next item is the J. Crew, and it is shipping to. Wait, did she not pay yet? Somebody. Somebody who. Oh, they paid. Why can't I print shipping label? Print shipping label. Here we go. Yes. <laughs> this shiny gold tone um, J. Crew piece, which I really liked. And let's put it in, see if it fits in one of these. I think it will. Okay. So what's going to happen? I know this. This is going to shift all over the place. So to stop that from doing that as much, I'm going to cut just a little bit extra like we can do. Great. And I will put this in a bag. And we will put it with some matching tissue and this piece sold for $14.99 to Donna. Hi Donna. Put a sticker across there that says thank you. Some nice periwinkle light blue. husband is still outside. He came in for a quick break, but then he went right back to the car. He keeps a lot of things in our car. We have in our emergency pack bags in case we ever had like a fire at night or needed to leave last minute because of a hurricane or an earthquake. We would um, be fairly well set to just jump in the car and have at least a change of clothes and some you know, some money and stuff like that. So we keep that in the car. We also keep some of Bear's music equipment in the car since he pretty much needs it on a regular basis or did, <laughs> hopefully to be used soon. Let's do, I really like this pinky color. So we'll go with that. So he's just cleaning it out as best he can. Honestly, he didn't really need it. He just cleaned it out. But the man likes to be clean. No complaints here. So three point something ounces. It does not matter what the something ounces was because it rounds up to four. So they paid $14.99 and $3.99. My cost was $2.76 purchase and post. open and paste print and print now this person had also ordered earrings I cannot find these earrings for the life of me I'm gonna give it a little bit more time and go through every single bin but I've already done that and I have a feeling that the earrings probably got re-donated. I don't know that. I'm really usually quite on top of things, but things happen occasionally. So I'm gonna give myself a little bit more time. She just paid for it. If I cannot find them, 
I will refund her. That was part of this um, package. She ordered the two things. This is the only one thing I could find. So I'll ship them for free, of course, if I find them. If I can't find them, I am going to give her back all the money she spent on the earrings and all the money she spent collectively on both pieces shipping. So she'll get free shipping for this one item. That way it's more than fair. This printed on the wrong sheet of that. <laughs> and, um, you know, by me taking care of the free shipping for her, she actually wins a little bit. But I remember photographing them. I have the photographs. I just don't know where they went. So let's try that again. Now that I have the paper in the right way, print for Donna. Good. I have similar earrings. I could see if she wants those, but they're a different color. Um, the blue is the same, but it's got a different base metal. So I wouldn't want those because I'm sure she wanted to wear them with this. jewelry again I cannot find those earrings I refunded her it's done but it'll bother me <laughs> this is a sterling silver marked st. Christopher protect us it's an oval it has st. Christopher with looks like a child nice sturdy silver silver chain Let's see if I can do it with my fingers being numb there we go. Um, this is headed to Carol in Virginia. She paid $9.50. This was on auction and $3.99 for shipping. So I think we are going to do the aqua box. Looks rather nice. It's about 4 p.m. here. I feel, I feel great that my shipping will be done, <laughs> hopefully by five, and everything packed away. Very nice. There we go. And let's do some tissue. And then nothing else should sell, and I say should sell, because occasionally, even with my store off, something gets through the cracks and sells. And I'm sure if I called eBay, they would be able to figure it out, but I haven't called eBay. <laughs> Just like that. Well, I'll have to ship that now. done with the inside of the car. We're going to make sure to have a cooler packed with ice, just a little like lunchbox cooler for my mom with some waters in it of her favorite kind because it is probably going to be in the low 90s here when she comes in Wednesday. She might even want to go over to the pool Wednesday evening. That would be nice. Maybe not. No pressure, mom. Okay, so let's get a business card. This one is completely white. That's not going to do anybody any good. And a sheet mask. And I think we'll put this in the little blue poly padded mailer. There we are. After this, I am going to make myself some ramen noodles. I haven't had any since yesterday. 
three ounces. It's 2.7, we get rounded up to three. Like I said, Carol purchased for $9.50 plus $3.99 shipping. My cost is $2.84 shipping. And print. Print. On there for her. Thank you, Carol. And the last one is a lightweight hand knotted pearl strand. And let me see if I can pronounce this right. Y A L I T Z A. Yalitza. Very pretty. Uh, $3.99 for the item and $3.99 for shipping. So I have the item up. I pulled a few pieces of what I thought it was, and it's going to be this one. <laughs> Sometimes pearls and bags look very similar. I do write the millimeter, so I knew it had to be one of these. And I want to just make sure. It's definitely this one, so that's good. Yay me. So these will now have to be tossed back in. Let's put these, do you want to do a silver or a blue? The blue fits in the blue chiffon. I can get them to look halfway decent. I think we'll do the, the teal color. is leaving Wednesday. I think we're going to put together Father's Day cards for some of our uncles and friends before he leaves, but I'm not sure about that. When is Father's Day? I think it's 15th, 21st? It's the 21st this year. Oh yeah, so we don't have to do that. That's good. That'll just take something off of our plate. A lot of bubble wrap there. Do I have a big enough? I don't. Maybe I'll just cut, cut a big enough strip to go around rather than try to tape it. As long as I can get one side into a bow, I think we're going to be fine. Yep, we're good. Okay, tissue. Last time I did shipping, I set up three tables and got out all of the tissue paper. And after a while, I was like, what in the world did I do? Like, I don't need every single tissue paper every single time. I mean, maybe it makes for a slightly better viewing experience. But for me, it's just easier to pull out a few different kinds, make it nice and simple. down for a little bit as well. Did I say that already? <laughs> that usually goes without saying for me. And then I can work on editing a little bit later tonight. Here. I don't know, I might keep the you are enough 
The contrast isn't as high as I had previously wanted, but they still look okay, I think. I think. Put some of this back away. This is the box. What is this box for? I don't even know. But this is the box I pulled everything in this morning. Oh, it was a box full of boxes. It was my jewelry boxes. <laughs> Okay, so last one. Let's put it in a berry bag. And put a, let's see, I guess we'll do a, a mask since it's right there. I kind of like the yellow and the aqua and then this like muted one color. 3.6, so we round up to four. Four, and this is headed to Puerto Rico. Now, Puerto Rico is part of the United States. There is no more shipping than any other town or city or village or state. Um, I know Puerto Rico, some people wrongly think it is its own um, country, but Puerto Rico does belong to the United States and so you can easily ship there. So Puerto Rico, shipping for four ounces is $2.93. Purchase and print. Puerto Rico, it should get there, I'm gonna say maybe five days, so shipping takes slightly longer, but not too bad. And print, and print. Well, past misplacing the earrings, I think this went off very well. And I am excited to have all of my shipping done for tomorrow morning, right before four o'clock in the evening on Sunday. Again, I shut my store down last night, so <laughs> it wasn't like I was going to have all of these sales. Selling 20 something items in one day is pretty impressive for everybody, but, but that's okay. Okay, somebody wrote back. Oh, the person with the earrings, I told her, I'm so sorry. I looked everywhere. I checked every bin and I said, I refunded you in full. She said, no, it's fine. Really? I understand. I've, with, I've been there. We've all been there. So yay. <laughs> oh, this one does not have tape on it because I forgot to put a label in there. So we are going to go old school and just tape this on. There's a few ways to do that, but I'm going to use my eBay shipping tape because it'll go a little faster. regular tape to go across the bottom. Again, that's just my fault. I have plenty of labels. I just forgot to put an extra in there. Yep, that'll do it. Thank you so much. Cards. Oh, and I wanted to I'll make sure to put some of that confetti in my book so it'll cheer me up when I see it. Thank you to those who sent us things and cards. Thank you for spending your time with me. I'll talk to you soon. Have a wonderful evening. Bye. We hope your day is blooming with joy.